A Burnsville father is being called a hero after he saved his kids from a carjacker. Derek Achi chased down his stolen SUV that had his four children inside, all of them under the age of five. WCCO's Reg Chapman shows us how a father's instincts kicked into high gear. Derek Gochi was in the 800 block of Russell Avenue North dropping gifts off to a friend. His wife Deanna had taken the last item out and asked him to shut the trunk to keep their four kids inside warm. I'm shutting the trunk. This guy jumps out of this mini, this taxi minivan, runs to my truck and jumps in. And I run to the door of my truck and I try to open it and he just takes off. The minivan left behind was also stolen. Gochi says his dad instincts took over. I just see my truck heading down the, the road and I noticed the van is still on the road and it's running, the door's, the door's wide open. And my first thought was I'm jumping in this van and I'm going to get my kids. Within a few blocks near Penn and Plymouth Avenues North, Gochi caught up with a carjacker driving his SUV. We were heading down the wrong way, down the one way and there was a vehicle coming towards us. So he, par he pulled off behind parked vehicles to let that car by. And as soon as he turned sideways to get around the parked vehicle, I just rammed the back of my truck, trying to, get, trying to pin him against a fence. The suspected carjacker jumped out and ran. I run up, I check on the kids, I look back at, or I look at him, he's halfway across his parking lot and he's just yelling, I'm sorry. The kids were okay. The family SUV damaged but repairable. Eventually, Deanna made it to the scene and police were the first to tell her what happened. First thing I said, did you find my kids? And they said, your husband did. Deanna not surprised of her husband's actions. She and others call him a hero. Derek says. Not really a hero. I mean, like, I'm a dad doing dad things. My kids, I, they're coming home with me no matter what. In Burnsville, Red Chapman, WCCO, 4 News. Police are still searching for the carjacking suspect, but they were able to pull fingerprints off of the stolen SUV. That person faces carjacking charges and possible kidnapping charges as well.